Hey, how's it going? Today is boss fighting day. Not just any boss. Today we're going for the Alpha Fenrir here on Fyodor, so it should be interesting. We're taking in one of the Paleo Greater Uties. We'll be riding that one for providing the boosts. And then for our damage, we're taking in 19 of the Paleo Rex. So there is one problem with that. For everybody, the Rex and the Uties, we only have primitive saddles. So all the drop runs and all the open world bosses, I couldn't find any more blueprints to make any more. So that's going to be going to be one part that I'm kind of worried about. Let me show you some stats and we're going to jump right in. I actually got everybody set up on here before we started recording. I know, I know, don't expect it always, but I came somewhat prepared. So for the UD, he's got 70,000 on the health, 4,000 on the stamina. That's mainly to constantly provide boost. Only 815 on the damage. I don't plan on doing too much fighting with him. We might do a little bit of munching if we have boost kind of topped up and stuff. We'll see how it goes. And then for the Rex, I kind of changed it around. So normally for any kind of Rex, I'll put at least 50 or 60,000 into the health. I only put 34,000 in this one. All the rest went into damage. So 1,700% on the damage. That way I'm hoping to overpower them and kind of take them out before we lose all of our health. I mean, that's a plan. Not saying it's going to happen. But 1,700 plus the mate bonus and then the uni bonus. It should be a good bit of damage. I'm hoping. I'm hoping. However, let's go ahead and start this boss fight, man. We've got all three of our trophies that we need. And one Alpha Fenrir coming up. As you can see, I did bring my flak armor today. We mean business. <laughs> it's mainly to help out with the damage. It's got really good damage reduction. It's got the good durability to last, and then it kind of provides some warmth too, right? It gets kind of cold in the arena. So we'll, we'll see if we make it out with it. Please tell me everybody made it. We need all of the little feet that we can see. I think we're doing good. I think we're doing fine. Let's go ahead and take a little bit of water. Up on this guy. You will get everybody to... Follow us. Start heading over here. Everybody coming? They are. All right, guys, there's your targets. Hopefully, they will go ahead and surround them. That's what I'm really hoping. And that way, everybody has a chance to bite them. We got flying Rex and a flying UD. That is not a good thing. All right, we need to keep boost up. Oh, we are so far away from the pack. We got launched. That's all right. We got some boost on some of them. I need to get up there and make sure we keep our boosts up. Dude, we are frozen. We are going so slow. At least we have the damage from some of the minions. We got all of our wrecks are frozen up here, too. Oh, this is a horrible start. Horrible start, guys. Back up, man. Clear a path. There we go. Get everybody boosted up, man. He's doing a thousand damage to our teams. Holy crap, dude. Right there, right there. The big guy, the big guy. There we go. We're doing a thousand unboosted and 1300 boosted. Okay, got more flying wrecks. That's, that's not a good thing. Terrifying, actually. All right, so we're going to keep these boosts up as high as we can, man. Well, <laughs> did you hear the UDL whenever he got frozen? I mean, good reason. Okay, yep. yep, yep, yep. We are in a very, very bad spot here, man. Our wrecks have already got some blood on them. The Fenrir is down about a third, so that's not too bad. Get the boost up, get the boost up. All right, we're doing good, we're doing good. We're taking a lot of damage on the UD. We have all of the minions on us, which is fine. There we go, we lost our first Rex. Let's turn that off so we can see. Keep boosts up, keep boosts up. I might as well go ahead and do a little bit of biting too. Okay, everybody got froze but us. Fantastic. Oh, dude, our wrecks are looking horrible, man. Let's turn these damage numbers back on. I need to see what's going on. So he's got about a third left on his health. Lost some more wrecks. Okay, we're taking a ton of damage. I'm about to lose our UD. All of these little wolves, man. Here we go. Boost them, man. Boost them. Oh, I need to back the UD up. Yep. Oh, I was afraid of that. Okay, we're still doing good. We're doing fine. We're under quarter on the fin rear. The wrecks are still looking okay. We're losing some. It's fine. It's fine. I need to get another boost going. I need to get another boost. There we go. Another one. Get another one. Dude, he's got a sliver of health left. We've almost lost all of our wrecks, though. A little bit more, guys. Oh, dude, I'm going to lose our UD, too. Get him. Nice, man. Oh, dude. That was nuts, man. Oh, guys, we almost lost all of you. Look at our UD, man. Dude's got like 7,000 health left. Guys. All right. Make some way. Make some way. Let me get this. It's the last thing I need. Gotcha. <laughs> nice. Oh, so worried about not getting a Dermis. Let's pick these guys up just in case something happens. 
Ah, oh, dude, that was close, man. That was super close, dude. That's gonna be all meat and stuff, right? Not worried about it. Pick you up. We good? I think we're all right. That was a very, very close call. So we got one, two, three, four. We got 500 on the elements. We've got our our skin there. We've got our dermis. Oh, wait, that's our trophy, not the skin. Oh, we got a skin here. That's for the... Okay, we'll talk about that here in a minute. Let's get out of the arena. Reevaluate our life. <laughs> get back to base where it's safe. Oh, dude, I am so glad that is over. Nice, man. Nice. All right, let's... uh. Let stuff load in. Textures looked a little bit weird. Let's get back to base, and we'll look at the team's health, and then I want to look at the Finrear that we got. Where is he at? Right there. There's the one that we got to see what kind of colors we got on it. Hopefully something good. All right. Yep. There we go. We got the weird hitching post stuff. Okay. Everything loaded in. Ah, uh, dude, that's fantastic. So, yeah, two, three, four. There's 500 element. Nice. Nice. And then we've got our flag here. We've already got one of the flags. We're going to set it out anyways. There we go. There we go. And then we're going to replace you with an alpha one. <laughs> nice. I do like the beta. I mean, it's blue, man. How could you not like it? That's right. We have to do this weird thing where we take everything out. We put you in. We'll leave that one in there, too. Kind of cool. I like how the eyes change. I do like the blue one better, but there is that one. Let's uh, get over here. Put this one in here before I forget about it. And then we've got... We'll do that in a second. So this is a skin. I think we use it on a tech sword, if I remember right. Requires a tech sword, okay. Oh, 190 to use, but I think we can still put it the skin on it. Let's double check. We do got one. I got that over on Extinction. Can we make it? We can. <laughs> it's not the best on durability and stuff, but are on the uh, damage, but we'll take it anyways. There we go. Please tell me we can equip it. We can. I think we just can't use... We can't! You gotta be kidding me! I thought we could equip it, we just couldn't use it. Like, use the special part of it. Because it's got a charge attack and stuff. Oh, that sucks, man. Well, we do have that. We are going to save it for later. we got to be level 190 or 155. I think it requires you to have all Explorer notes and stuff. I am not going through and collecting all Explorer notes. I'm going to use console commands to unlock them. However, all the boss fights and stuff that we need to do for getting 190, I will do. I will gladly do those, but I am not collecting all the Explorer notes. Dude, there's like hundreds of them, man. I mean, it's like, where's it even at? It's pages and pages of Explorer Notes that you have to get all these. Because I think that once you get all of them, you get plus 10 levels? Is that what it is? You can't see because of my the way I have my screen at and stuff. But yeah, I think it's you get plus 10 levels. So we need that at the end, too. Hmm, that's something we'll deal with later. So, let's go ahead and put out our trophy first. Wait, we have this. We'll do this one. It'll be fine. I think that's the better one anyways. Oh, dude, that was so tough. Let's look at these guys first. So, 4,000 on him. 800 on you. 3,700. Not Yeah, we almost lost a whole pack, man. If we would have been there another 10, 15 seconds, we probably would have totally got wiped, man. Totally got wiped. And there is our alpha one. Let's change the pose a little bit. There we go. Do the howl, man. That is a terrifying thing when it does that howl. We are going to do something with the trophies and stuff. Like I said, I want to set these guys up. And then redo our trophies in here and stuff like that, too. But, let's take a look at the Fenrir. Here's the main thing that we wanted to see. So, the colors on it are not the best looking. It looks like the base health is 6,000. The stamina is 1947. 416 on damage. And 1,020 on weight. So, not too bad. We're going to take it out of this. We're going to grind this and never use it again. I don't like the colors on it. The colors are extremely plain compared to the mod map version, so I'm kind of disappointed on how they turned out for the official. I don't know, it would just seem a lot better on the mod map with them. So we got 35 on the health, 35 on weight, 35 on damage, 49 on stamina. Let's do some comparing here. Not sure why I jumped, but it happens. Let's put you there. Okay, well, let's just put them all on here, it'll be fine. 
I'll sort them out later. So let's do some comparing here. So this is the gamma, beta, and alpha. So yeah, it is. It's uh, 25, 30, and then 35 on base stats. It's kind of weird how... So I think you get a random stat that's higher than the other. So like on our gamma version, we got some extra points into oxygen. Fantastic place for them to go to. And then for this one, we got them into weight. And this one just happened to go into stamina. I think, I mean, that's fine. It's fine. So to get a uh, armor of 10, it says, too. Interesting. Get everybody out over here. Front and center, guys. I want to see if we get a pack bonus with them all. Oh, wait. Are they all females? How did I get all females? I wonder if there's any male ones. So this one doesn't look too bad. That's the beta one. And then this is the alpha one, and that's the gamma. I really hate the gamma. <laughs> it looks horrible. So that's a level 225, and then I don't know what the base level was on this one, or that one. I think that was a 150, I think that was a 100, something like that. So we still got a pack bonus, we don't get a mate bonus though. Interesting, tell you what, let's go for a little stroll, man. We got a point, let's put it into, so you get 688 per click on that one. We'll save these, I want to see what kind of damage we do, and then we'll put a point into it. Super slow though. Is it 100%? It is. Hmm. wonder why it's so low. I figured it would be like 120 or something. Watch, we won't be able to find anything to munch on out over here. So I'm hoping... <laughs> That's weird. When you're trying to run and jump. Maybe because we're going uphill. But I'm hoping that we'll get a mate bonus as well. Once we get like a male one, if we can. It might be just all females to kind of keep you from doing any birdie. So 229. That is not much at all. Yep, 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 come on, buddy. There's stuff coming. And then 238. Okay, so it goes up a good little bit. Scale's all right. So what we'll end up doing is... Oh, man, I don't know. I don't know. I was hoping to use these guys to do the Alpha fights, like the Alpha Fenrir. Take all Alpha Fenrirs against the Fenrir. But I don't think that's going to work, just because of how much damage we just took doing that boss fight. So, maybe whenever we get our full pack, what we'll end up doing is maybe some of the other bosses, right? Like the dragon, like Abithicus, and the Broodmother. Ah, oh, man, that is rough. That is super low damage. And then let's see about our special abilities. I keep forgetting what we got. So that's our defense. So that goes up to armor 80 whenever you have that activated. Right? It does. So it goes up to 80. From 10 to 80. Interesting. Okay. 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 And we got this other one. Which I can't do. There we go. Don't run, Junior! Where is everything at? I want to do some testing, man. I want to do some biting on stuff. I want to see about this freeze if it does any different with, uh... Having our pack bonus here, too. See what? Well, there's some carnals right here. Gonna be a bad day for you. I can't do the freeze. What is going on, man? Yep, Michael Raptor. Oh, was there a... Uh, there's a cooldown. Maybe I hit it and I was in the air so it didn't work. Yep, Michael Raptors. Alright, man, I'm wearing flak. You're not gonna hurt me anyways. Yep, okay, okay. There's a bunch of them. There's a bunch of them! Oh, dude, I'll tell you what. It's always a Micro Raptors. It's always a Micro Raptors! I just want to do a little bit of testing. So, which one is... This is our new one. Right? It's not. Did you? It's not. Wait, what? Did I put more points into health? I didn't think I did. Hi, guys. Let's go over here, man. Take out this dude. I'm really not impressed with the damage on these. Hate to say it, but I'm really, really not, man. It's different whenever you got teams that have the saddles and stuff, but not having saddles, it just totally, uh... Totally takes away from everything on them. A level 20. Super low level. It'll be fine, though. I want to see about this ice breath, man. 
436 it does on that. That was the ice breath one. Let it recharge again. Dude, I tell you what. <laughs> Micro Raptors. <laughs> oh, come on, dude. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Bad day for you, just saying. Did he get all of us? Nope, just me. 197. 236. That's about team there. All right, guys, follow me. All right, put everyone on passive. One last test before we go. So that does 218 and does free stuff. Why did not free stuff whenever we were in... We were doing testing in the cave, right? With all the little dragonflies? It didn't do anything there to those with the freeze. That's what I was looking for. Still does. Good. Are we stuck? We're bugged. There we go. I don't know, man. I don't think it's going to be too viable for... Oh, we're out of stamina. That's right there. One reason why we won't be able to use them in boss fights. Because I think whenever you use that bonus for the armor and stuff, I think it takes away from... your stamina, right? It does. Pretty rapidly, too. Oh, dude. At least we got, like, 2,000 stamina on this guy. It goes up a bit, too. Okay, turn it off. Turn it off. Buddy. Got the ants on you. But they got this last Bronto and we'll head in, man. Oh, dude. I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm kind of disappointed in the fin rears. I think if you could breed them, that would change a lot, too. You could get such a bonus from breeding them. And we don't get the imprint bonus, either. You know, whenever you have a team that you... that you bred. It's like an extra 33% damage reduction and damage, so kind of, uh... Kind of helps out a lot. Let's go ahead and pick these guys up. Ah, dude. Well, fairly good day today. We actually beat the Alpha Fenrir with our Paleo Rex. Now, I mean, it was close. We lost a bunch of them in the process, but that was all primitive saddles. If I can get some better saddles, it'll make that so much easier to do for the boss fight. Same with the UD2. We need a better saddle. Everything will go a lot smoother. These last couple of fights we've been doing with primitive saddles, so it's a. Uh, it makes a huge difference, you know, in how much damage you're taking. However, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. If you enjoyed the video, hope you liked our Alpha Fenrir fight with the Paleo Rex. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.